Makes sense. Yeah. So they it's had funny because I told somebody, I said, man, let me tell you something. They're no longer trying to make, they're not trying to make any more Rockefellers, mm -mm. bad boys, <laughs> all that. Mm -mm. And the thing is, these artists now work for that. Mm. They work for that. Right. They can't come to Toomp and say, hey, man, listen. I'm gonna give you this chunk boy, this chunk boy situation, but I'm gonna have you the hottest thing in the city. Right. You be like, boy, you out your mind? Where the oh, yeah. money at? Yeah, where that where bread the split? At? Yeah, where the numbers real. at? Yeah. So now you get a bunch of kids that don't care. They want to be popular. They already giving it away. Like, like one time I walk up, and uh, man, I pulled up at a studio, and you know me, it was <laughs> it was a perfect situation. I, as soon as I pull up, I see a white right, guy. All the right people were there, huh? Oh, my God. <laughs> I know you can just let I loose see, on that. I see a white guy and a bunch of rappers, a bunch right. of folk around him. Mm -hmm. I'm like, this looks interesting. <laughs> I get out of the car. <laughs> Who was it, man? Who was it? I, I, you go, I would just okay, say, okay, but you okay. go get it. I know. I walk up. I say, hey, what is it? Oh, man, it's such and such. Man, he, owned the, uh, he got a mixtape site. I said, oh, this is who that is. Okay. I said, shout let me explain something to y'all. I say, so y'all spend all y'all time and hard work putting together this music to give it him, to him to give away for free. Give it for free. I say, so y'all get on his site, give all y'all music away for free. I say, but guess what? He's getting paid off yeah, advertising. He put some fucking tag off on it. Right. Yeah, it's fucking right. No, no. I said, no, hold on, man. Hold on, hold on. I say, so he's getting paid for y'all to give y'all music away for free. Does that even make sense? Y'all empowering him. It's that new generation. Because y'all giving away the music for free because you just want to be popular. Guess what? And, and how many out of that bunch of people, how many you think really listen to what you said, though? Probably none of them. Nah, niggas don't listen, bro. <laughs> oh, to that oh, shit, oh, man, that old, oh, that, that old head shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Niggas don't want to hear that. They don't want to hear that, man. And it's, and, and it's like, and see, the thing about it, dog, was really, killing the industry. If people heard me, I've, I've said it before, and there's only a few people real enough to say this shit, is that right now, the music industry is the only, the only, well, let's make this shit clear, the only <laughs> industry that you can get into without a certification, without being educated on anything. Listen, man, if you want to open a barbershop, you got to learn about all that shit to pass the yeah, state board yeah, and absolutely. your sinks got to be a certain way. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. If you want to open a wing stand, it's cold. You got to pass, pass inspection. Yeah, you got to, yeah. But a motherfucker who got 300, you know, from hustling money, you know, okay, sitting under his mom's house or wherever he got his money at, wake up and just stretch and be like, shit, man, I'm gonna start this label going and put some money behind these little youngin'. He's the CEO now. That's it. And don't know nothing about publishing. Don't know anything about licensing. Don't know. Don't. Don't even know music. Period. Mm -hmm. Like this is the only business that you could do that, and that's why you got so many criminals in this shit right now. Absolutely. You know what I mean? Absolutely. Like, and not not you know, a lot of these dudes are really from the streets to this industry. Mm -hmm. No filter. No type of development. It's bad, bro. So one of the major things I think, one of the biggest reasons. I honestly believe the DJ is the cause for what the climate is now. The DJ. And I'm gonna tell you why. Cause there used to be a time where everybody listened to the DJ. Mm -hmm. And we depended on the DJ. Yeah. If the DJ said, this is it, boy, that's we it, rock we riding it. with We rocking with right? it, yeah. So now when you were able to pay the DJ, oh yeah. So now the DJ hey, turned man, it into a hustle. Yeah, it's a hustle. Now. It's like, so you telling me all that is it? So anybody got $1,500 is it? Yeah. It don't make sense no more. Yeah. How bad music got to be uh, for niggas to stop taking free CDs? Yeah. No, nah, cause I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm just like, give me some jam <laughs> shit. <laughs> you see what I'm you saying? You don't put, shit. you don't flooded the block with so much bullshit. Yeah. Because of the money. Right. That I don't even got time, like, to yeah. even try to, I don't even want to figure it out. Yeah, no more. folks don't even want to even take time to listen, give it a fair listen. Come Somebody on, man. brand new. Yeah, it used to be a thing to uh, break a new artist. That's man. all I'm saying. Uh, that was a, a pride of a DJ to be like, they would say, I broke this artist. Mm -hmm. I broke this new mm -hmm. TI, I broke this new such and such. You know what I mean? Yeah. But now, yeah, no.